What's up, you guys? So, <clears throat> a lot of technical difficulties. Um, when I look back at the film, this is not the video I imagined. The reason why I went the night before is to record what it looks like um, at nighttime and when it's empty. And then I was gonna like snap my finger and it's gonna go straight from dark and empty to light and full of people. So that was the idea for this part, but it didn't turn out that way. And this is what we have. So without further ado, I'll let you get back into the video. A lot of people out here. Good morning. Good morning. 2020. Being part of history. Turk is here. They see the back of my shirt. Y'all see the front of this shirt. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Y'all see the back of the shirt. Y'all see the back of the shirt. Don't forget to subscribe. Y'all know what the time it is. They can throw that like in. Y'all know what time it is. It is Turk time. Look at these people. These people are so weird. And I gotta live with them for like four days. Look at this <laughs> one in the middle. She's so weird. She done a bunch of weird shit and people sleeping, like listening to music, dancing, and drinking Patron. But we out here, we in DC, making history. This is history. You know? Those are the two weird ones I was just talking about. They're not normal. Oh, hey, guys. <laughs> That's domestic. That's that raspberry. It's time to get your knee off our neck in this country. Look, we got work to do. You got a lot of speeches you're going to hear, and I'm not going to make mine long. Get ready to get to work when you get back home. If you come here, enjoy the speeches, clap your hands, make a lot of noise and go home and do nothing, you have done us no good. When you get home, let me hear you say go to work. Shot in the park for playing with a toy. Choked to death just because. Murdered for being black in a white neighborhood. Shot in my car while rushing home to get medicine to my daughter. Killed in the stairwell for trying to catch an elevator. Gunned down in Walmart for holding a toy, all for no price, for no ransom, for no reward, just because I've been labeled as less than human. I'm black. I'm other. I'm not like them. My music is too loud. My hair is too kinky, too nappy, too dreaded. My pants are too saggy. My shoes are tied. I'm wearing a hoodie. I walk too fast. I look intimidating. I'm a threat. A menace, a societal scourge, a casualty, a neighborhood nuisance. I can't win. 
I can't get a job. I can't get a raise. I can't find respect. I can't make ends meet. I can't breathe. What do I do when I can't breathe? We reject the process of dehumanization. We see everybody as our neighbors. We go back to God, who is the source of our breath. And we will let them know that we are not going anywhere. We will ensure that this revolution will be televised. We will ensure that this movement will continue in an intersectional way, in an intergenerational way. And we will not allow for this democracy that has promised us equality and justice to not make sure that they keep that promise. And if it doesn't happen today, we will make sure that in November we push for that promise. Because we know that this country, in this very stage that we are standing on, the Lincoln Memorial was built off of the backs of our ancestors. part of history right now. This is some real history. At the end of the day, the March on Washington was a good experience. It's um, better than I imagined. Baltimore wasn't the best stay, but being in D.C., um, being empowered, being next to all these people that support the movement, and just the phrase itself, Black Lives Matter, was like life-changing and being with the people I was with. Um, you know, I was with my boy Steel. I did some walking with the people that was in the house from the previous videos. I met up with Mystery Girl. And um, it was it was a dope experience. I would go back and um, if I could go back, I would do things a, a little different. So I could give you guys um, the content that I imagined. Um, yeah, it was a dope experience. I mean, if you have any questions about it, if you plan on going yourself, I would highly suggest it. And, um, and not just to march on Washington, but just use every day to make our voices heard for everyone not just to each other, but the people who don't believe that we should have the things we have or take away things that we do have. So I'm Turk and I'm out. Thank you for watching this video. Dad, what's wrong?